Bitcoin retested one of the most important support levels of this entire trend and on that level yesterday I opened up a 120,000 US dollar Bitcoin long position that is making me more than 6,000 US dollars in profit in just a matter of a few hours and in this exact video I will talk about Bitcoin, what levels we should be looking at right now, what are the levels of support and resistance, what are the big levels of interest, how am I trading this entire range and what will be the next gigantic move for Bitcoin so make sure to watch this video till the end because this video will be so important I will give an update on my trade on my 1 million US dollar Bitcoin trade that I'm currently going to be building up and much more important stuff so don't forget to slump up that like button on today's update video can we smash it back above 500 that will be absolutely incredible and with that of being said let me jump straight away in towards the content so yesterday we saw Bitcoin come down here and just the day after the SEC announced that they were going to sue Binance they came out that, that they're also going to sue Coinbase for allegedly 16 coins that are securities. So that is very interesting and ever since that news hit the market, Bitcoin formed a new lower low here, but it was trading on this very important box of support, talking about the 25,000 US dollars. I have been talking about 25,000 dollars for such a long period in of the market and I've always said once Bitcoin is going to reach that 25 to 24k target, I am going to start up building my long position for Bitcoin and I'm going to be planning to open up a 1 million US dollar Bitcoin long position. Like you can see, ever since we hit that target bitcoin bounced back towards the upside with an approximately eight percent towards the upside within a matter of hours to be exact bitcoin bounced up by eight percent within 12 hours that is absolutely ridiculous and that is an absolute crazy epic move towards the upside all the way back up towards 27.4k if i'm looking at the trend right now here the level where bitcoin got rejected from is that exact range high here that previously around also provided resistance so that was of course not really unexpectedly and for me right now we're trading at support again because this lower side previously around provided support here it provided resistance so i do expect that the 26.7k is going to be the support to be looking at and if we do break above the top side right here we're probably going to see an even bigger continuation towards the upside because so far right now we only created that Bart Simpson pattern or that V-shaped recovery pattern and right now what we're really waiting on is to break above the previous high in the market. If we do so, the continuation is probably going to be even bigger but to be very clear, Bitcoin broke down of this consolidation phase. We talked about it. My price target was very close to be getting reached here and to, and to be very honest, if we're going to be looking at the price target, we can currently see that we literally hit the high price target or basically missed the price target by just a few dollars. So yeah, Bitcoin reached its price target, went down and after that basically straight away shoot up again here so this was definitely a beautiful trade to be seeing here and bitcoin actually did quite a good job here so ever since bitcoin saw that move towards the downside it basically started to retest this entire range right here what was of course a very important level i've been talking about for quite a long time right now here and I said on yesterday's video that I will be longing it. So that is exactly what I did here. So far, I opened up a 120,000 US dollar Bitcoin trade. But to be very clear, I set up multiple orders on the lower side as well. For if Bitcoin is going to fall lower, I'm going to add even more margin. And I'm planning actually to be building up this trade to not only a 120k trade, but towards a 1 million US dollar Bitcoin long position with low leverage. So currently, I am in a 5x leverage long position for Bitcoin. And I'm planning to drop more and more capital in towards this position so if i'm going to be investing two hundred thousand dollars of my own money in this trade use a 5x leverage it could become a 1 million US dollar trade here it's realistically speaking quite low risk here because i'm going to literally dollar cost average in towards my trade here towards the downside here so i'm not going to open any more margin right now here and if bitcoin goes up I will be definitely fine with it, but if Bitcoin comes down here, what is still a very possible scenario, I will just add more margin. What will make what will make my average entry price go down for Bitcoin? What is definitely a lovely thing to be having, of course. So this is exactly how I will be approaching my trading strategy right now. This is how I will be doing it. If Bitcoin comes down lower, I'm just going to add more margin. If Bitcoin goes up, I will be definitely take it because then, of course, I will make some more profit. So far, I'm only making 0.2 Bitcoin in profit, and that is about what is it? five to six thousand US dollars so so far it's not really a significant profit that I'm making but it is definitely for the long term it could turn out to be a very profitable trade here because what I'm here trying to do is open up a swing trade for the next big run-up that I personally think is going to hit the markets so if you're interested in swing trading or following me with me so if you're interested in trading or swing trading or following me with any of these trades don't forget to first of all subscribe to the channel because yesterday on the video I literally showed you my trade here what was literally in zero percent profit 
here. It was even in a small loss. And if you're interested in trading or swing trading at all, go to BitGet in the link in the description. You can trade there without KYC, without VPN. If you sign up an account, you can already get free 15 US dollars as welcome bonus. And after that, you can claim a deposit bonus up to $50,000. So go to the link in the description if you're interested in trading without KYC and without VPN. It's definitely the best exchange out there right now. And at the same time, looking at Bitcoin, I've been saying this for quite a while right now here. We are forming quite a bullish pattern here actually on the daily time frame. But like I said in my videos, a falling wedge tends to be breaking out 8 of the 10 times towards the upside. So it's definitely a bullish pattern. And uh, I still think Bitcoin can come down to 24k. That's why I still got my order set up over there. But it does make a lot of sense to see this pattern break towards the upside. And if you're actually looking at the daily time frame, we have finally seen that retest here on this level. And I've been talking about this level for such a long time here. Bitcoin previously around created that left shoulder, that head, that right shoulder. We created inverse head and shoulders pattern. And right now we finally saw the retest of the neckline. What is definitely a very bullish retest in my opinion. And you can see the reaction. Bitcoin touches it and it bounces back towards the upside within approximately 8%. And I was the one on the channel that exactly told everyone here to be longing Bitcoin. And I told everyone here on the top side to be starting to short Bitcoin. I literally said on my videos, on $31,000, I started to become bearish on Bitcoin. And yesterday, on yesterday's video, I opened my first long position in a very long time. And I said to everyone out there that I'm turning bullish again on Bitcoin once it goes below twenty six dollars to $24,000. So I flip bullish on Bitcoin. I am buying more Bitcoin. If Bitcoin comes down to 24K, I will remain to be bullish here. So this is exactly my strategy. Bitcoin retested the most important trend line. And I'm not sure if we necessarily are going to see another retest. But if it happens, I will definitely make sure to benefit from it and add even more margin at the same time we can currently still see here bitcoin is currently retesting the ema ribbon on the weekly time frame so far we're seeing successful bounce happening from it yesterday we were literally trading below it and right now we see a significant bounce from it so that is looking quite okay here here on the weekly time frame bitcoin creating that inverse head and shoulders pattern we've officially also saw the retest we retested the neckline and straight away we see a very big wick on the lower side so that makes it also very interesting for me and if you're looking at the 200 weekly moving average yesterday we were trading below it but already we wicked back towards the upside we bounced back towards the upside and bitcoin is looking quite strong if you would ask me here so that was it for me on today's update video i think this pattern right here the falling wedge looks extremely exciting in my opinion i will be waiting to see to see what happens if bitcoin breaks the downward sloping trend line if we do break the trend line towards the downside i think we could see a significant move towards the upside do remember if i'm looking at the bullish bands the bullish bands on the daily time frame is starting to narrow up again but of course if i'm looking at the three-day time frame we can see that the bullish bands is extremely narrow and due to this we're expecting a big move to be happening anytime soon so get ready for that here the bitcoin is still trading in a tactical daily uptrend here also on the weekly uptrend we are seeing that retest of this very important level it makes all a lot of sense for me here i've said it several times before i flip bearish on bitcoin on 31k flipping bullish right now on 25k and so far after my call bitcoin went up about eight percent here so i'm going to be trading this again here i'm expecting that bitcoin can go all the way back up to thirty one thousand dollars and maybe even beyond if we do break above it it's going to be very bullish for bitcoin but anyways that was it for me in today's update video slap off the like button if you do enjoy the content subscribe to the channel if you want to be staying up to date and i'll see you guys on the next one peace out goodbye